Tilly Tink Tink here with another Timeshare Talk and today I'm going to talk about uncovering the Timeshare presentation. Um, you know, a lot of Timeshare companies will offer really great vacation packages and in order to get these really good deals, the free tickets, the really low prices for the whole stay, things like that, um, they require you to attend a timeshare tour and I love offering these packages to my referrals um, because they not everybody can afford the type of luxury that these resorts have but at the same time a timeshare is not for everyone so if a timeshare is not for you, but you still are wanting to get a really great deal on your vacation, this will give you some insight into what goes on in the timeshare tour to help you decide whether or not a timeshare is for you. This is some, um, actually my story, uh, what I went through um, during my timeshare tour, and these are all pretty much the same the same things um, and so basically they uh, we walked in we made our appointment we walked in and there were people everywhere all kind of food drinks kids balloons loud music was playing it was like a big party in the middle of the day and so we were standing there just kind of you know taking it all in and all of a sudden, a loud voice came over the speaker, and I really couldn't tell what the announcer was saying at first. But then, like, all of a sudden, the family that were sitting at the table next to us jumped up, started cheering and hollering, and everybody in the room started cheering and hollering and clapping. It was so loud, my little nugget got scared, and he was actually over by another table where he shouldn't have been. And he ran over real quick and hugged onto Ronnie's leg, and that's just how loud it was. Um, and I couldn't really make out what was going on, but the, uh, the salesman, um, guided us very quickly through all the people. I mean, there were people just zooming everywhere and, um, took us outside where he, we got on a golf cart and he took us around to the whole resort and he pointed out all kind of stuff, the amenities. And I have to admit, it really was very beautiful, um, these owners were definitely paying their maintenance fees and he actually told us that that was what the HOA fees were for. Um, the landscape was beautiful, it was very well decorated, it was very, very nice, very luxurious. Um, I wish everyone could vacation like that honestly because it was really, really beautiful. But we finished the tour and we came back to the big party room and uh, sat down at the table. They got us food, drinks, the kids had balloons. There was actually one of the salespeople actually helped watch the kids while we did our presentation and honestly the whole thing was like a blur. Um, I remember sitting there drawing squares and numbers all over papers. Um, they sent two different people to talk to us and throughout our whole meeting like Every five to ten minutes, people would jump up and holler and scream. There was loud music playing. And it didn't take me long to realize that when people jumped up and screamed, that was people that were actually buying the timeshare. And so we negotiated back and forth. And um, we I actually still have the little papers that we drew everything on. I can't legally show them, I don't think. But um, after we finally settled on a price and keep in mind this takes about three hours it's way longer than 90 minutes if you're going to buy a timeshare it takes hours to negotiate and but it's it's worth it if you are really wanting a good deal on your timeshare the way that I teach you how to do it is worth it um, but if you are just wanting to say no I'm going to give you the resources to be able to do that as well um, but after we finally signed off on that, we actually had to go to another room with another person and we actually had to sign a lot of documents saying um, that we understood that it was a timeshare and how to use it. Um, honestly, I did not fully understand at the time how to use it. 
I'm just being honest, but I said that I did. Um, but if you are going on, on a vacation with a package that includes a tour, that is what you will expect. That's what I want you to expect in your presentation. And so please do not go in there and sign your life away and make a hustled, quick, um, uneducated, unthought about um, decision. I want you to know as much as you can before you go in there. And there's also great articles that I've written for you to be able to learn everything that you need to know if you're wanting to buy a timeshare, if you are going on one of these vacation packages, if you already own a timeshare, I have tons of information for you. The link to Inside a Timeshare Tour is in the description of this video. It's very easy to find, but there's so much there for you. I have a list of questions that you're going to need to ask at your timeshare tour when you go on this vacation package. This will help you to be able to say no if you want to, and this will be able to help you ask the right questions if you are serious about buying one. Another free resource for you is timeshare vocabulary words. It's very important that you know what they are saying and understand what they're saying to you. Then I have checklists, I have downloads, there are so many resources for you in that blog. Also, everything a timeshare owner should know. Make your vacations, make you money. I wrote this book specifically for timeshare owners so that you will be able to lower your payments, recoup your costs, and learn how to use your timeshare, how to rent it out, how to make passive income. Everything that I went through as a timeshare owner, I put in this book so that you can learn from my mistakes and from my successes. And the link for this book is also in the description of this video. And it's available at tillytinktink.com. Here is Tuesday night, 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. I'm on Facebook Live Premiere. Um, answering questions for you guys. It's a great place for timeshare owners to meet up and discuss questions that you may have and advice that you may have. Um, I'm also available under the name Tilly Tink Tink on these social media platforms, Pinterest, YouTube, TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram. I wish you the best of luck on your vacation. I wish you the best of luck in your timeshare tour. Please use the resources um, that I mentioned, the research checklist, the questions to ask, these will help you in your timeshare and vacation ownership.